Yeah, this is pretty, pretty fantastic, actually. Ah. Let's make this all into one movie. Maybe figure out how to upload it. Just taking another view over here. Wow, yeah. It's pretty hot <laughs> and pretty, you know, it's, it's beautiful. Uh, really, but it's literally afternoon, so it's probably not as bad as it would be earlier. Wow. So we're about halfway. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I can't tell. Well, I know this is very hot, but I don't mind it, but it's... No, I'm not regretting it at all. I mean, I might get very tan, though. <laughs> Actually, I'm here taking a little bit of a break. In the shade, it's very hot. And we're about not even halfway. It's been really a nice walk. I'm kind of glad that I'm doing it. <laughs> Wish I had more sunscreen on than I do. But really idyllic and I think there's so much here that you could make a painting out of you know just almost any spot if you wanted to and I wouldn't really go out of my way to come all the way up here for like the trees but um, I would generally speaking want to go and look at you know the mountain but this is really kind of pretty nice well I'm gonna stop it now so this is a reservoir in Aix, uh, well, it's in Biblis Quarry, and I think it's got that Mediterranean kind of cerulean blue-green that, you know, you can see in tropical environments. You can see that, but you can't really see it. I mean, it's, it's, this is similar to the Cezanne painting of, the, you know, the Mediterranean, but his colors, I guess he muted them a lot. He made this like a flat plane, which is actually what it is. It kind of this kind of like flat looking. Now what am I not seeing? Here? Oh, okay, I'm seeing it. Uh, looks like it's going to rain a little bit. This is okay. It's threatening. You know, actually, I'm just looking at this here and thinking about this trip and all the peace and the different feelings I've had here being in Delacroix studio and feeling the profound peace that I felt there seeing all the art in the, in the Louvre and Dorsey um, and all around looking at this and looking at Cezanne's studio and I think that I'm just so grateful that I got a chance to come here to see this, you know, so that when I look at Cezanne's paintings now, I actually kind of understand where and how he created it, not just from a book, but because I, I was here myself, touched and saw it myself, I saw a lot of the motifs that he painted directly from, and I, and I did it in a way where when you're here physically and just present, you can take in so many levels of information that you can't do from a picture that you can't do any other way. And I know if I came back here another time, I'd feel differently. But I'm just looking at the colors here, just the luminosity of them and the beauty. I'm even looking at that smokestack in the distance, you know, and thinking about even as the rain clouds begin to, to go, just how beautiful this area is for a painter, or just for anybody, really. And now I'm going to stop.